I woke up last night and I saw my boat bobbing nicely in the ocean, so I was wondering what's going on. I was like, the hurricane is here. So then that's what's going on right now. I mean, rough seas are stunning away the hurricane. That's what's going on. Yeah, nobody could sleep bad. Yeah, nobody nobody could sleep good last night. Hello, welcome to the one channel right now. We're doing with Hurricane Francis. We have Mike we have Mike signed on live in West Palm Beach. So if you're saying we did see some damage from Hurricane Francis caused over roof toppling off. We also see some cars go by. We saw a lot of things coming from this hurricane. I mean, here's a picture um, of West Palm Beach. And we are feeling Hurricane Francis very slightly. Here's some damage. It tore down some trees. Traffic lights are on the street, definitely, from this hurricane. Take a, take a look at Hurricane Francis moves towards the Bahamas and going to Florida right now on live Hurricane Center weather coverage right now with the Weather Channel. Daytona Beach is also evacuations on the way for Hurricane Francis as they decide their plan for the hurricane and how they will deal with it out. So here's Hurricane Francis right now. It is a Category 4 currently moving at west-northwest 13 miles per hour with a pressure of 949 millibars. As you can see, this 395 miles away from Flagler Beach. And there are hurricane warnings for Port St. Lucie all the way to Florida City 7 Mile Bridge. Since Central Bahamas is also going to get some of that hurricane warning as it also will get some Hurricane Francis in its path. Here's the projected path for Hurricane Francis. It's supposed to go to make landfall into Sunday morning. That's what's going to happen. It's currently 2 p.m. and we'll be back with more Hurricane Francis coverage. Now, hurricane coverage continues on the Weather Channel. Back to highways and interstates. Cars are packed with clothes and food. They're trying to get out of the way of Hurricane Francis. The watches and warnings cover over 14 million people across Florida, and they're trying to prepare. But where will the storm ha track? We have the latest projections. The Weather Channel Evening Edition tracks Hurricane Francis right now. Hello, I'm Paul Goodlow. And I'm Jennifer Lopez. We'll be seeing tonight tracking Hurricane Francis as it moves toward the Florida coast. We got some reports of winds here. The hurricane advisory is from Melbourne, Vora Beach, into West Palm Beach, Florida. The hurricane warnings also go into Miami from there. Um, here's Hurricane Francis, still a Category 4 with 140 miles per hour winds moving at west northwest, 9 miles per hour with 948 millibars in its path. Currently, this hurricane does look bad. We have some people on the scene to talk about it. We've seen some evacuations the past hour, and that's what we are worried about. Maybe not enough people will be able to evacuate. Right, Jeff? Yeah, but we're also talking about the way that people were also evacuating and shopping for the goods to get out of the hurricane. I met with some other people today. They were evacuating all across the coast. We were watching. These were people evacuating. We saw more evacuations than usual just for a Category 2 hurricane coming to Florida. Jesse and her boyfriend moved over or to Miami. This is their first hurricane and they don't know what to do and they're completely clueless. It's scary. I mean, I've never done anything like this. I know what to do. Like I'm 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 very clueless. I don't know what to do. I mean, we're filling up the gas, but they're not going to give us anywhere because they started closing down because of the hurricane is already coming. So we don't know what to do.
And we're back with more Francis coverage on the spot as Hurricane Francis evacuations are building up more on the coast. Hurricane Francis is definitely coming to Florida, whether you like it or not. It is already smashing the Bahamas apart on the coast as tonight on September 3rd. Hurricane coverage continues on the Weather Channel. Hello, I'm Pongo Lolo, and I'm Jennifer Lopez. Right now, Hurricane Francis is getting more dangerous across the coast, as we see tonight. Hurricane Francis's damage already caused some flooding across the sea coast. We're watching that also. Here for Fort Lauderdale, Florida, getting ready for Francis. They've decked up all the boats. Sailors and Marine have come back to the station, and they're ready to ride out the hurricane. Here's Francis, now about to make landfall on Florida tonight with sustained winds of 105 miles an hour and moving west-northwest at 6 miles per hour with 960 millibars. Stephanie, we're not going to go to you in Palm Bay. Mm -hmm. Everything's going completely fine over here. We got um things going on right now. Whoa, it's getting crazy over here. Whoa, there's a piece of debris. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here's some pictures from Hurricane Francis of what the flooding has already done to the streets. Boats are rocking across. People trying to swim their way out of Hurricane Francis. And here's some damage to the Ferry of Francis in Nassau, Bahamas. Damage not over yet. And surfers being swept off their feet in Hurricane Francis. Hurricane Francis sure has some good surfing waves. If you're in Miami, it's not the best to swim, but people are taking their time for that. Hello, I'm Chris Peter, and I'm Anathi, and I'm Bill Keneally, and I'm Kelly Cass. Right now, we're going to bring you next to Francis coverage right now. Here's some serious things going on across the coast from Hurricane Francis. As you can see, there are some damage left behind, punished by Hurricane Francis. It's still making landfall as a Category 2 from now on, and we have Mike Seller on the scene. So as I was talking about, we are also seeing some strong winds from Hurricane Francis as the it moves in more often from the west coast onto the east coast it's not very pleasant as you can see some boats have already flooded the street and people are trying to swim out of the hurricane's way it's not the best to swim it's best to use your common sense and like swim away when things are going wrong so if you could do that that would be a great decision now hurricane coverage continues on the weather channel Howling winds at Nassau, Bahamas. The hurricane is, is slamming the region right now. Francis is also heading to Florida. They're already getting some pretty strong winds and some pretty heavy rains. A live report will come from that area next.